Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Much of the discussion of elements up until this point has focused on what we can do to edit our raster image elements. Remember that raster image elements are pixel based. So when we use any of the painting tools, for example, we're creating changes to the pixels in the specified layer. Now we are going to turn to the drawing tools and learn how to create vector based image elements. Remember that a vector-based image element is one that is defined by mathematical terms. As such, these elements can be resized, moved, and warped without losing any of the original object's resolution. It is for just such reasons that the text that we create in our images is often vector-based. This allows for resizing and manipulation of the text without sacrificing text edge clarity and definition. Now we will examine what other tools we have that allow us to create vector-based shapes in our images. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.